Are you considering buying the Fisher Price baby tub? Well, in this video, I review it with pros and cons to help you decide whether it's for you or not. Stay tuned. Hi, I'm Dan, and welcome to Parent Pacifier. On this channel, we help new and soon to be parents with tip videos, stories, and product reviews just like this one. So if you're new here, consider subscribing and hitting that bell icon so you never miss a video. So if you're looking for a baby bath option that won't break the bank, I absolutely recommend this Fisher Price baby bath four in one sling. So the first thing that stands out about this tub is the price. It's one of the lower cost tubs that has a lot of options within it. So if you wanna look at the price, we've put the link in the description below that'll give you the most current price of this tub. It gives a lot of options. It's got four in one, so it has this sling that sits in here for newborns. Our baby is four months old. He actually still sits in this sling. It uh, keeps him comfortable within the bath. It also has this seat that you could sit right in here and as the baby gets older, they could switch into this seat. And even as they get a little bigger, you could sit them here and their butt just sits right on this part to uh, stay seated and keep their head on this rest up here. This tub is also fairly lightweight. So you could pick this up, move it around, bring it to the sink to fill up and move it around your apartment or house with ease, even after it's filled up with water. I also like this little hook right here. It's a very useful feature. You could hang it up in the shower after the bath is done so it could dry, or even in the summer, hang it out outside. And then for storage, you could put it right up on the wall and it's out of the way. That's the one thing that's so that we have to deal with with baby stuff is there's just stuff everywhere. You could hang this up on the wall and it's just out of the way. It does have these bottom legs to fit in a sink, but the cons are is that your sink has to be big enough for that. Ours isn't, so we have to sit this down on our table and one of us has to hold it to make sure it doesn't fall because it slips just like that. <laughs> and that's also just a safety concern. So that's one con for this. You could also sit this right in your tub um, or on the floor. And one thing that is annoying about this sling is that the baby sometimes does slide down and that throughout the bath, every once in a while you have to pick the baby up and put him back up into the top of the sling. Because otherwise he starts to get soap or water in his ears and that's just annoying to deal with. So that would be one other con that I would say about this. Now to clean it, you could just take this sling right off the tub and you could throw this in your washing machine and it's ready to be cleaned. And inside here, just take a sponge, clean it down and you're good to go. And this also comes with two accessories, this little squeeze bottle and this little cup with holes at the bottom. We, at this point, rarely use this cup, but as it gets older, we may, we may end up using it. But this is an incredibly useful feature. What we do is we squeeze and then suck up the water and you could use it to pour over his head and then to play some games with them as you play, pour some water over him, just like a shower spout. It's a very useful tool. Now, one accessory I wish it came with was a thermometer. So you will have to get a separate thermometer for this tub. Now we recommend the Aquatopia Safety Bath Audible Thermometer and Alarm. And we have a video all about baby bath temperatures and you could get that right here in the YouTube card or in the description below. Now once bath time is over, you could just unplug this plug down here at the bottom. Water pours right out into your sink or slop sink or into your tub and you are done. So if you're interested in the Fisher Price 4-in-1 Sling Baby Bath, you could click that link in the description below. Now question for you, what baby baths do you use or are you planning on looking at? Put your answers in the comments below. Thank you for watching and if you're interested in another Parent Pacifier video, why don't you try one of these selections? And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We look forward to seeing you again.